Nearly 50 million Americans are planning on hitting the road or taking to the skies for Thanksgiving. Today is one of the busiest travel days of the year. And the Colorado Springs Airport is accommodating the increase. That's where we find KRDO News Channel 13's Angelica Lombardi live with more on holiday travel. Good morning, Angelica. Well, John and Dana, AAA predicts a record amount of people traveling this Thanksgiving. It's the most since 2007. And the best time to leave was early this morning. And that was the case here at the Colorado Springs Airport. Nearly 800,000 Coloradoans will be traveling this Thanksgiving. I'm just going home to visit family. It's been like five years since I've been home, so it's been a while. Passengers lined the Colorado Springs Airport early to beat the rush. Headed to Savannah. I teach at Air Force Academy, the men's basketball team. They're out there playing a tournament, and I'm going out there to be a tutor. And my family just happens to live in that area, so get the most of both worlds. The packed parking lot gives an idea of just how many people are flying the skies. We've made preparations to accommodate those passengers. Um, we've added some shuttle buses in our parking lot to help accommodate uh, more parking, and especially with that parking promotion that we have going on right now. Uh, we've added that shuttle buses to kind of alleviate the stress in our parking lot and keep things moving. The airport is also offering a promotion for $1 parking a day. Since the airport added new frontier flights, they say they've noticed an increase in passengers and even hit a record month. In September, we had a 20% increase in passengers over the previous year. October, I believe the percentage was an 11% increase. Airfares for Thanksgiving are up 21% this year. But regardless of cost, one passenger tells us he prefers flying out of Colorado Springs for the shorter wait time. I've had experience with Denver before and noticed how crowded it was, so I just figured that, you know, if I could get a flight out of Colorado Springs to Tampa, which it flies direct, it would save me time and effort. It's recommended you arrive two hours before your flight. And of course, always check with your airline before you come to the airport to make sure your flight is on time. Reporting live from the Colorado Springs Airport, Angelica Lombardi, KRDO News Channel 13.